In this video, we'll show you how to change the air disc brake pads on a Thomas Built Safety Liner C2 School Bus. To change the brakes, you'll need the tools seen here. Prior to beginning, make sure you release or cage the brakes, as well as support the vehicle with proper jack stands. Turn off the engine and chalk all the wheels that remain on the ground. Start by removing the wheel and tire to access the brake assembly. Remove the clip using needle nose pliers and do the same for the washer. Press down on the pad retainer to remove the pad retainer pin. Locate the adjuster on the interior side of the brake assembly. Pull off the adjuster cap using the tap, taking care to keep the shear adapter in position on the adjuster. Using a box end wrench or socket, fully wind back the tappet and boost assemblies by rotating the shear adapter in a counterclockwise direction. If rotated correctly, you'll hear a click sound. If you turn the wrong direction, the shear adapter is designed to break off to protect the caliper. The service kit comes with new ones. You're now ready to remove the old brake pads. Now that both pads are removed, visually inspect the rotors for wear, cracks, or grooves that may require replacement. Simply slide in the new pads, making sure the pad material is facing the rotor surface. Reinstall the pad retainer, retainer pin, washer, and clip. Turn the shear adapter clockwise until the tappets make contact with the pads, then turn back two clicks to set the running clearance. Finally, put the adjuster cap back over the shear adapter. Repeat the same process for the other side of the axle. Always replace brakes in complete axle sets. With that, your new brakes are ready to go.